assalamu alaikum students today i am here with the explanation of exercise 1b question 1 new syllabus mathematics t1 resource book page 21 so what is the uh, question 1 of exercise 1b find the highest common factor of each of the following sets of number so we have the parts group 1 to d in the uh, part a and b we have two terms and in the part c we have three terms Part A and B is related to the practice now 9 that I explained earlier and part C is related C and D is related to the practice now 9. Uh, so the practice now 10. So if you read out the question, there is no boundary or limitation that you have to solve this question with the uh, listing method or table method. So you can solve this question by your best approach. So question uh, 1 part A. HCF of 12 and 30. So, uh, first question I will solve with the both the methods and later on just apply one method. So, I will solve this question by listing method. Make the factors of 12 and 30. To 6 or 12. 2 3s are 6 and 3 1s are 3. Same, make the factors 30. 2 1s are 2, 2 5s are 10. 3 5s are 15 and 5 1s are 5. So just write down the factors of 12 and 30. Factors of 12 are 2 multiply by 2 multiply by 3 and factors of 30 are 2 multiply by 3 multiply by 5. Now we are going to find the SCF and the SCF means that common factors. Taking the common factors of both. One common factor is 2 because 2 in both the terms. Now we have the 2 in this factor but now if you look the factors of 30 there is no more 2. So left the 2 here because it is uncommon. Now 3 and there is 1 also 3, 1, 3 on factors of 30. So make the pair of these 3. So the second common factor is 3. Now if we have the 5 on the factors of 30 but there is no 5 in the factor of 20. So left, uh, left the 5 and um, now multiply the common factors. The common factors are 2 and 3. So 2, 3s are 6. This is all about the listing method now with the help of table method. In table method basically we solve the LCM. We'll take the SCF of all the terms all together. So we have the two terms 12 and 30. We'll divide the terms, take that table that is divisible on both the terms at once. So take the common table, uh, it is divisible on 2, 2, 6 are 12, 2, 1 are 2, 2, 5 are 10. Now both the tables are divide, divisible on the table of 3, 3, 2 are 6, 3, 5 are 50. Now, 2 and 5 are not come in the same one table. So, these are the factors of both the terms. 2 multiplied by 3. We have two factors, 2 and 3. So, 2, 3s are 6. Now, part B. In part B, question 1, we had the two terms, 84 and 156. Now find the factors of 84 and 156. First of all, take the factor of 84. 2 4s are 8, 2 2s are 4, 2 2s are 4, 2 1s are 2. Again, it is divisible on 3, 3 7s are 21, and 7s are 7. Always divide with the least possible approach. Hamisha sub the chodi table. First of all, I'm going divide. Now 156 again, 6 is the even number, so it will be divisible on 2. 2 7s are 41 is carry so it becomes 16. 2 8s are 16. 2 3s are 6. 2 9s are 18. Now it is all number and divisible on 3. 3 1s are 3. 3 3s are 9. 13. 13 is only divisible in its own table. Now write down the factors of 84 and 56. 84 having the factor 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 7. What are the factors of 156? So we have the factors of 156 are 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 13. Now take the common factors as SCF is equal to common factors. 
Now common factors. First factor is 2. So write in common factors as well. Send 2, 2. Again, this 2 make one factor. Then 3, 3. Now we have the 7, this factor. But if we look at the factors of 156, so there is no more 7. Now we have the factor of 13 here. So if we look at the factors of 84, so there is no 13. So left the uncommon factors because we are only working with the SCF and SCF working with the common factors. Now multiply to 2 is a 4 and for 3 is a 12. So 12 is your answer. Also this solve this question with the table method. So table method. There's no mention in the question that you solve this question with the table method. I am solving this question with both the bad methods. So all the students uh, clearly grasp the concept and the method that they uh, approach or the method they are using. So there, may, uh, there will be no more query about the method. Okay, they are solving the method with the listing method, uh, table method. So they face less difficulty by solving the question. So the table method take both the uh, terms at one time, 84 divide both the terms at a time and 156 so 2 will be divisible in both the terms 2 4 are 8 to 2 is a 4 and then 2 sums of 14 is carried to 8 are 16 again 2 is divisible in both the tables because the last numbers digit is even so 2 2 is a 4 2 1 is a 2 2 3 is a 6 2 9 is a 18 now these four terms are divisible on 3 because 3 7s are 21, 3 1s are 3, 3, 3 are 9. Now we have the term 7, 13. There is no any table in which the 7 and 13 is will be came. So that means these are our uncommon factors. Now write the common factors. Our SCF is 2, 2, 3. 2 2s are 4 and 4 3s are 12. So your answer is 12. Now compare the question that your answer in both the ma uh, matters is 12. So whatever the matter you are applying, your answer will be same. Now in part C, question 1, we have three terms. Find the SC of 4, 50, 60 and 75. Now first of all, uh, make the factors of 50. 3 5 is 15, 5 1 is 5, as well as factors of 60. Last digit is 0, so 0 is an even number, so it will be divisible on 2. 2 3 is 6, 0. 2 1 is 2, 1 carry to 5 is 10. 3 5 is 15, and 5 1 is 5. Now, factors of 75. 5 1 5, 5 5 is 25. 5 3 is 15, and 3 1 is 3. So write down all the factors of the terms. 15. 15 is equal to factors 3 multiplied by 7. The factors of 60. 60 have the factors uh, 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5. And 75 having the factor 5 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 3. So take the common factors. So in this question, we have the common factors. First is 5. So first common factor is 5. Then we have 3 on this, 3 and 3, also 3 on uh, 75. So take the 3 common. Common 1, 3, 2 and 3. So we have only two common factors. One is 5 and second is 3. So our answer is 5 to 15. That is all with the table of listing method. Now solve this question with the help of table method. In table method, we take all the terms all together. Now take uh, the uh, table that is divisible on all the three terms. So 3 is divisible on the three terms. 3, 5 is 15. 3, 2 is 6, 0. 3, 2 is 6, 1 carry through 5 is 15. Now, 5, 1 is 5, 5, 4 is 20, 5, 5 is 25. It is not more divisible because 4 and 5 not came in the same table. 
सो वी हैव अ कॉमन फैक्टर दैट इज इन दिस प्लेस थ्री मल्टीप्लाई बाय फाइव दैट इज योर डिवाइड इन सो थ्री मल्टीप्लाई फाइव इज फिफ्टीन एंड दैट इज योर एस सी आंसर नो क्वेश्चन फोर इन क्वेश्चन वन पार्ट डी वी हैव सेवेंटी सेवन नाइन्टी वन इन वन फोर्टी थ्री सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल मेक द फैक्टर्स ऑफ सेवेंटी सेवन सेवन वन सर सेवन सेवन वन सर सेवन इन इलेवन वन सर इलेवन फैक्टर्स ऑफ नाइन्टी वन सेवन वन सर सेवन टू कैरी इट विल बिकम ट्वेंटी वन सो सेवन थ्री सर ट्वेंटी वन थर्टीन वन सर थर्टीन सो फैक्टर ऑफ वन फोर्टी थ्री इलेवन वन सर इलेवन थ्री कैरी इलेवन थ्री सर थर्टी थ्री एंड थर्टीन वन सर थर्टीन सो राइट ऑन द फैक्टर्स ऑफ सेवेंटी सेवन सेवेंटी सेवन फैक्टर्स आर सेवन मल्टीप्लाई बाई इलेवन एंड फैक्टर्स ऑफ नाइन्टी वन आर सेवन मल्टीप्लाई बाई थर्टीन एंड फैक्टर्स ऑफ वन फोर्टी थ्री आर इलेवन मल्टीप्लाई बाई थ्री नो एच सी एफ इज टेकिंग द कॉमन फैक्टर्स नो we have 7 7 and there is no 7 in this so left is 11 there is 11 and there is no 11 in this we have 13 in these two factor but there is no common factor that will be again in three terms we if we have 7 in both these terms so there is no 7 in the third term if we have 11 in both these terms so there is no 11 in the second term and if we have 13 in the last two terms so there is no 13 in the first term so there is no any common factor but there is when there is nothing common so there is a common one 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 because one is one ones are one definitely came so we didn't divide that one so we will write that we have a scf that scf common factor is one because one ones are one one ones are one one ones are one 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 is always a common there is a number of a That's mean a multiplied by one because it gives the reflex term a. One is basically the reflex term. If I have two, so what will be the factors of two? One multiplied by two. So one is will be always occur. If I have the number ten, so definitely one multiplied by ten. So we can take the common factor as one. So S C F S B these three numbers are one. So if I will do this question with the help of table method. It is one step question basically. So there is no any table that will be divisible, uh, common table that in which the seventy seven, ninety one, and one forty three came. But we have the table of one, one seven, seventy seven is seventy seven, one ninety one is ninety one, one forty three is a forty three, one forty three. So we have a factor, S C F, one. That is your answer. So it is all about the. Um, Question number one of exercise one B that is related to the S C F for S C F both the matter with the table method and listing method. Also in the exercise one B there is no uh, limitations on boundary that you solve this question by this method. But uh, I have done all the parts, all the four parts with both the method. So what is need to do at the end? Kindly subscribe the channel and press the bell icon or also press the thumb button.